Hey, what's happening guys? I'm sure you remember this little device here underneath the oscilloscope. I call it the supercomputer and it's basically an homage to the same thing that uh, Big Clive shows in all of his live streams. These are simply 1.5 Hertz self-flashing 5 millimeter LEDs. They require other than resistors to limit current, no other support circuitry. And what's cool about them is when you first turn them on, they all come together. And then the little IC in there, instantly, they start drifting. And you end up with a really beautiful pseudo random pattern. Reminds me of the computers of the 1960s that you would see on like uh, old television shows at the time. So, why did I bring that up today? Well, Big Clive has done some, or supporters of his have done some with SMD LEDs. Particularly uh, uh, a guy named Mouse, I believe. So what I've got here are some 0606 red slow flashing ultra bright LEDs. These are from Lighthouse LEDs. And these are self flashing 6x6 red LEDs. I also grabbed some resistors kit. These are 1206s. And, uh, well, you know how much I love SMD work, so let me show you what I have in mind. So here is my, uh, my idea for the little supercomputer badge. And yes, these funny looking things, I actually had to create new footprints and uh, objects. So there's just 25 of these here. They're just in parallel. And they each have a 1K resistor to keep the brightness down. Here's my layout idea. There's Rock the Pittsburgh Panther. And their little saying, Hail to Pitt. So, one thing though, these are the 1206 pads for the resistors. These are the six six pads that I created. I fear they're not going to work. And there's really not a way to print this out to find out. I have found out. Maybe there is and I don't know. So here's my idea for it. Little pin you can wear. You can wear it to the football games and whatnot. We'll get them uh, sent out and have them made. So this video is sponsored by PCBWay.com. And if you take a look right here, they are right now having their free fifth PCB design contest. You can participate in this. You can win great prizes like $1,500 cash or $200 coupon in a Raspberry Pi 4. The Raspberry Pi 4 alone right now is probably worth $200 due to the uh, supply line problems everybody's having. Our participation prize, you get a Pico. Popular design prize, you get a uh, digital multimeter. I mean, this is so cool. You know, thanks to them for doing stuff like this. This is really, really cool. So anyway, what we're going to do is we're going to order our stuff from PCBWay, of course, and it's really, really simple to do that. You just click down here on PCB instant quote quick order PCB add your Gerber file. In this case, it's called Hail to Pit. Sometimes this comes up blank, sometimes it does it. It's no problem. I want five of these or two layers. They are going to be blue and white. No edge connectors. Tick. Then you can come over here and choose whatever uh, shipping method you use. We're just going to grab USPS here. It's rather 
affordable to get our five boards in a couple weeks for thirteen dollars and thirty four cents all right we got our boards the back of them look particularly nice the front however I fear my creation of the footprint has gone awry let's bring out some tools Let's see where that out. So those were supposed to be six by six. They are one point three two by about one point three two. My uh, My foot pin drawing seems to have a scaling problem. Yeah, there's there's no way I can make that work. So, unfortunately, these beautiful boards are going to have to go in for a version two. But doesn't mean I can't practice a little bit of soldering on there now does it let's get set up for that I need all the practice I can get <laughs> everything I need is ready to go let's see how we can do here A little flux on there. What I'm going to do is simply tin this first pad a little bit. Then I'll grab the resistor. Hopefully it should just kind of melt into place there. Then I can do the other side. 1206 is not a terribly hard size to do. Try a few more of these. See if I can't get you a better view here. One moment. All right. Oop, bump the camera as usual. So we'll start with tinning. Then we'll grab our resistor. Heat up the pad. Drop the resistor on it. Yep, and want you to jump right out. Try again. Heat up the pad. Drop the resistor on it. And then the other one good practice and I certainly need it so I'm gonna spend some time working on my SMD soldering skills are you gonna focus and we'll redesign this board hopefully with the correct size pads and try again because it's too beautiful to go to waste 
I'd like to thank PCBWay, as always, for being a fantastic sponsor of the channel. I'd like to thank you guys for watching. That's it. I'm out. Peace.